hate us. Yep, hate us. Hate Always hate. What are you gonna do? Nothing. Nothing. I got my toothbrush. What are you gonna do? Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. uh, uh. Step number six, bitch. I'm hating on you. Let me get my shades. Let me get my shades. <laughs> Gotta make your shades. Got my swagger back. What's up, assholes? It's Mr. Sunday here, and I actually got something really exciting for you guys. You remember way back when, when I said I was gonna shave my head? Yeah, that's gonna happen today. All of this, gone. And we're gonna get some footage so you guys aren't left out. But, I do have a magic trick for you guys, so check this out. Hey, yo, tubers. What the fuck? All right, like he said, his hair, hair, gone. Zip, out of there. Two hours from now, it's gone. He's going to be bald. And it's all for you guys. All, all for, for, for you. you guys. Now, to introduce this topic for this week, I am going to have my buddy Elliot tell you guys what it's about. All right, guys. So, if you were in a horror movie situation, you know, scary flick, you know, scary movie kind of thing, what would you do to be the sole survivor? Well, guys, it's done. The man of my word, it's just I had, I had a little game plan of what I wanted to do. I'm going to put some of the footage from us shaving the head at the end of the video, so make sure you stay tuned to that. That's going to be some bonus footage. And like Elliot said, uh, this topic is what would you do in a horror movie situation? What would you do to be the sole survivor? And I'm about to tell you in just a second, what I would do, but uh, before I get on to that, uh, me and Elliot put on a skit that kind of relates to this topic, and if you want to go and check it out, you can just click this uh, little box down here in the corner, right below my armpit. <laughs> but yeah, there's a box with like a little skit playing right there. If you click that, it'll lead you to the video on my page that me and Elliot uh, did, and I don't know, it's pretty fun. What would I do in a movie, a horror movie situation? What would I do to be the sole survivor? I don't know about you guys, but I'm more of like a horror movie kind of guy. Like, I enjoy watching them. Uh, not the corny ones, at least. At least, like, the good ones. I like watching those. And, like, I was thinking about, like, uh, some techniques that they use in, like, the movies. And I don't know. I think that, like, the stuff they do in movies is... Like, they check out, like, the places that they think the killer would be. And, like, why would you fucking go and check that out if, like, you're not gonna, like, kill him or anything like that? Like, you know how, like, you know, like, the people, like, in the movies that are, you know, just sitting there? Oh, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. Don't go in that, don't go in that room. He's in that room. He's in that fucking room. Don't go in that room. You know what I'm talking about? Like, those people in the movies, like, they're screaming out loud, like, as if, the fucking people in the movie can hear. I'm like, don't go in there. Bitch, they can't fucking hear you. What I would probably do is, I would say, fuck everyone. Fuck everyone else. If it's people I care about, then maybe we can work out like a strategy or something like that. But if it's all people I don't know, fuck them. I would go and try and find, like, the closest weapon or the, um, the best weapon or... Anything like that, and then I'd kind of like hide and l wait for it to get kind of cool. And then after that, I'd probably fucking use the others as bait. And the slash and shit, or Freddy Krueger style, like, kind of use it as my cue to kind of go in and save the day. Hide for a little bit, you know, keep it cool. Uh, that video that me and Elliot actually did, that's probably what I would do. The fuck what I would use or any of that to take down the killer or anything like that in like a movie situation. Like I said, my strategy would be to go hide and use the others, if there are others, as bait or, you know, kind of, or a distraction. I would use the others as a distraction. I would be that guy to save the day. Because I'm nice. In a way. But yeah. That's all I could think about what I would do to be the sole survivor, and I'm actually pretty sure that it would work. I have a few things on my chest that I need to get off. One of them, dealing with uh, you members that 
don't post videos quite often. Yes, I know this isn't anything serious, you know, it's just for fun. We've been up and running for two months now, and we've only had one straight week where everyone posted. I'm going to try and be nice about this. Um, get on your A-game. Get on your A-game or let me know if you want to kind of drop out. There are people that would like to take spots. That's all I'm going to say. Leave us some suggestions on some topics because, you know, we do got a list, a pretty good list that we can use, but it's all about you guys. It's all about what you guys want to watch, what you guys want to hear. Um, so, I mean, don't be scared to leave, like, a comment in one of our videos or on our main page about a topic, you know. More than likely, we will do it if it comes from a viewer. I can almost guarantee you that we will because it's, like I said, about you guys. This is Mr. Sunday. And I'll see you guys next Sunday. Hey. Wait, can I just have like one last like moment? Well, yeah, let him have hair. one more moment. One last moment of Andy with his hair. A little bit that it does. Uh, yeah. Steve, yeah. we're just trying to get the hair off. <laughs> I want to do this. Man, is like once in a lifetime type of thing, dude. So These people, people are waiting. watching. Look, people there's watching. people watching. I know. We're there's doing like it. fucking like seven lurk. Oh. Would you like a little oh. trim, or are you gonna just you know? No drinking beer, sir. I might cut your hair too short. Hell, too late. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that thing is so fucking hot. Feel it.